Hi, I'm Christy from Way Beyond the Norm and welcome to our 39 foot fifth wheel. As you can see, this is our living room. There's not much to say about it. We've got seating for all five people in our family. We've got some great lights um, and some great storage space up at the top. Our window is huge. I would open it, but it's dark outside. Uh, so you're not really gonna see anything. But this is one of the main reasons why we chose this fifth wheel was because of the huge window in the living room. So normally we would have views like this. All right, we've also got a couple other nice features here. We've got um, a fireplace here, so that makes it great for cold mornings when the kids like to come in here, when they wake up in the morning, turn the, the fireplace on and sit in front of the fireplace. Um, and our TV is actually down in this area. So with a touch of a button, TV comes all the way up and then you can also put it back down so it makes for great um, cabinet space, countertop space. And underneath this on the outside is our outdoor kitchen. And then in here we also have another great space here for storage or um, drawers for more storage area. In our kitchen, you can see that we've got a kitchen that is a little bit different than probably any other RV that you've seen. Again, another reason we really enjoyed and really liked this particular layout. We've got the horseshoe shaped kitchen, great for one or two people. Plenty. We've got four drawers here. We've got some um, cabinet area underneath the sink, the nice big farm style sink, and tons of storage space and cabinets. We've also got in the dining room, the dining room table can be situated just as it is or it can be turned lengthwise this way. And this part of the table actually pulls out and makes it longer. We took the chairs out of this dining room and instead put in these bench seats because these make for fabulous shoe storage um, or homeschool supplies or we've got plates and cups and things like that in this other one. Our table also lifts in the center and we have extra storage space inside of the dining room table. And then one of the best features of our kitchen, we've got a wonderful residential style fridge. We love our fruits and our veggies um, and our fresh cooking supplies. So we definitely had to have for our family a, a nice big refrigerator. And then we've got the kids' bedrooms. So our girls, they're twins. They both share this bunk room. We took the sofa out of this area and built them a bunk bed. So they each have their own spot. These are twin bunk beds. And then they've got um, an extra little cabinet up here for storage of some of their items. And then we took the little desk that was out because it was just a shelf basically. We took that out and we put some extra storage in from Ikea um, for their clothes and blankets and other things. Behind the door, we have another little bucket system here where they can put crafts and jewelry and all that kind of stuff that they like to keep. And then above them, we have a lock. So we can pull this ladder out and go up into this area. And that is where our son sleeps. We got a little bookshelf over in the cubby from Target and that's where his clothes go. And then if you come back to this closet, I like to call this our homeschool closet. All of our homeschool supplies, books, and extra things that we like to use on a daily basis are in this closet. Come up the hallway 
to our room. We've got a large dresser where we keep a printer and a jumbo monitor and our air purifier here. We bring one of the stools from the kitchen and set it right here for me uh, for a place to sit at the computer. Normally what goes in this closet is typically a washer and dryer unit. We prefer to go do our laundry on the weekends um, at the laundromat. So we actually have extra storage space for more clothes and a laundry basket up top. This came with a king size bed, but we chose to get it in a queen size bed. Okay, and then if you come around, we have an extra doorway into the, um, into the bathroom. We've got a full size shower and we've got a little bit of a tub as well. So this is great if you have little kids. And then we decided to put in an extra Ikea um, cabinet here. We had some extra space. It was the perfect width and depth. And we've got all of our, we've got some towels and some homeopathic remedies and other things that we use on a regular basis there. And then it does have a door over here on this side to go out into the hallway. And that is our RV.